visiting pastor wants to eradicate illegal drug use and addiction in the Turks and Caicos Islands. Jodel Trell gives the details on this pastor's mission. You name it, I did it. Words from personal experience. Pastor Harry Williams of the South Atlantic Conference of Seventy Adventists is no stranger to the world of drugs. Before becoming a pastor, his life was riddled with years of abuse and imprisonment. After a life-altering tragedy, Williams devoted his life to the service of educating others about God and the dangerous effects of drugs. Before I came into the church, I come out of a family of dope pushers. I started selling drugs at the age of 12, from 12 to 33. Um, been in jail about 21 times. They slipped my throat, left me to die in the streets. All I knew was drugs and, and, and uh, crime. The drug sessions are a part of a three-week gospel series by the Turks and Caicos Mission of Seventy Adventists. Night after night, Williams informs people of the perils of drug abuse and addiction. We're trying to do some meetings to help the people on drugs, alcohol. So we're doing some seminars for parents to help them to recognize drugs, what to do about it, and how to stop. With Williams' drug councils, the Footprints of Hope gospel series, conducted by international guest speaker Pastor Richard Jackson, attempts to not only lead others to spiritual awareness, but to also educate them on some of the most detrimental social issues in society. We also have Dr. Rufus Ewan that will be doing some health um, seminars here with us over the, the weekend. And so it's a holistic program we are, we, we are trying to present here. The sessions will continue nightly until Saturday, February 29th, under a tent at the industrial lot on the Five Keys Road, while the entire gospel series will run until March 15th. For WIV4 News, I'm Joy Dell Trail.